Miss Lot of Holiday I hear. Yeah. Hey, hello. Good to see you. Good to see you as well. Oh, I'll uh so I'm respectful. Oh, thank you. So I'm glad you're here, uh, on such short notice as well. Of course, yeah. Oh, good. So, I did want to talk to you about, you know, you guys moving to Berezino, because I do think it would be beneficial for you to be there, you know. Over in Vibor, they have this little, uh, we'll call it a conglomerate, you know, three factions, I believe. And I believe maybe mm -hmm. Berezino could turn to something like that as well. I, uh, I like the idea. I really did. It's, uh, I heard it from Maverick's radio. He's still in a coma, so right now you are talking to the alpha of the group currently. The alpha, that's a strange way of putting it, but I'll just call you the de facto leader. Oh yeah, no, it's it's fine if you don't call me that. Uh, we we run a wolf pack pretty much, so I'm a alpha. We got a beta, and we got the uh, we got the pack. Yeah. All right. Before I begin, do you guys have a name that I should be calling you that isn't the Golden Grin? Have you changed or? Yeah, it's it's the wolf pack. That's oh, just right wolf pack. I see. I see. Okay, so I do realize your history, your past, and probably what you're going to be doing from here on out. Uh, just so I get my facts straight, do you mind giving me a rundown of what the wolf pack is, what you guys plan to do, so on and so forth? Uh, we're gonna we're gonna continue doing what we normally do, and that's helping out new people. You know, helping them adjust. You know, survival the fittest is what needs to happen, and some of these people don't believe in that. You know, they're trying to get new people and uh, scoop them up really quick and teach them to kill immediately. That's not what we want to do. We want to build a community. We want to make a big community. Pretty much oh. That's our goal. Certainly, yes. I didn't expect that answer, but very good answer. Uh, so I do want to lay out some things to make sure, you know, there's no misunderstandings between our groups. No way you have an embarrassing, you know. That's right with you, I suppose. Huh? I said I want to set it some, uh, uh, we'll call them ground rules, I guess. Okay. Alright, so that's nothing big, and I don't expect you'll be doing anything of the sort, but, you know, the the usual, like, we don't want any trouble being brought around bears, you know, so, you know. Oh, no, we would never do that now. Certainly, yeah, but at the CM10, you know, you can't really know what lies around the corner, so we do take precautions, even in our own group. Okay, yeah. That seems fair. Yeah, so I do just want to lay out this here right now. Uh, I know I'm not a leader in your faction or whatever, but I would like it if you guys didn't, you know, put out or sign up for any contracts, really. Like uh, defense contracts, that kind of thing. You got? You don't want us doing any defense contracts, any killing contracts, none of that? No, just because, like I said, it would bring trouble around the bears, you know, and we don't really stray for that. Uh, yeah, I did want to actually talk to you about that. We stopped doing that. Uh, yesterday, I think, was just a wake-up call for us. We, oh, we don't want to do any defense and contracts like that anymore. Uh, we recently uh, talked to a dude in Star. He's making a boxing club, and he wanted to know if we wanted to, you know, go around there and look like tough guys. And that doesn't seem much like a defense contract. That just seems more of a, hey, if you are planning to do something here, don't. Sure, yeah, I see, I see. We're just, we're just paid to be tough. Certainly, yeah. I know you guys were like a militia back in the day, like, I don't want to call you mercenaries, because that has kind of garnered a, uh, we'll call it a, a negative term in the past few days, past few weeks, sorry. Yeah, yeah so as you know, no, that's, uh, yeah, that's yeah. Fine. As you know, I mentioned on radio, uh, we do have neighbors in, uh, bear, yeah, bears, you know. Well, they're, don't, they don't have a group name, as far as I know, but one of them's called Dash, so he's a very good friend of mine. I will be letting him know if you're going to be mo moving in, just so you know, he doesn't get caught off guard. Okay. Yeah, they like I said, they live in the uh, the lumber mill, right next to the apartments. And by the way, apartments, I would go for some of them if you're going to be living, because they are very defensible. Take uh, quite a bit of walls, but defensible. Yeah. Okay, yeah, we can totally do that. Like I said... Uh, once this is fully, you know, finalized and we are ready to move, all we're going to need is some help moving some of our stuff. We have, like, six tents. Surely, yeah. And, uh, until 
not until, but as soon as this is ready, we're going to start breaking down some walls. We're going to start getting some nails, some planks over there with you guys, and uh, then we'll uh, start building in one of the apartment buildings. See right, how yeah. that goes for a few days. Yeah, what I would do first... <clears throat> Jesus, someone threw up. Uh, before you move, maybe send over two or three guys with the necessary materials to actually block off an apartment building. So when you get there, you know, you're not in a rush to get everything upstairs and, you know, so on. Well, there, there's also the thing of we, uh, one of our members got robbed. Oh, by who? Or let's not say robbed. I don't know. Never said names, never said anything. Guys, uh, held up one of our guys and he had pliers on him, so that, that was our only pair of pliers. No, well, we have pliers, we can lunch them, I suppose. Okay, thank you. That, that's, that, it's not like, hey, we need the pliers, it's more or less we ha we have to have them because we have a lot of stuff at base. We have three doors. Oh, no, that's no problem. I, I do believe that we're good friends, at least. So, you know, we'll lend you them, no problem. Yeah. Uh, I also wanted to uh, to talk to you about the events that have happened in the past few days and see how you're doing. Because I've actually, you know, when, when I consider people friends, I, 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 I care about them. I consider you guys friends. Surely, yeah. Moji, uh, I'd like to talk about it in specifics. Uh, to be honest, how, how did you feel about the raid? Did you, did you want it to go that way? The raid on, uh, the former Golden Grim? Oh, Efka, the people that, uh, I know, the I know. people that were involved in it. I, uh, I wish I were, I wish I was there. I wish I could have put, put a bullet in Yakov's son, you know, since I could have put a bullet in Yakov himself. But, you know, as, as oh, much as I, it um... it makes you feel any better. It, this is the gun that did it right here. Hmm. As, as much as I am, you know, frustrated that, you know, I didn't get the... Exact revenge, since I was robbed of that by somebody. I won't name. Uh, I am glad they're dead. I'm sure Julia tripping their heads off in hell. I just wanted to check in on you, man. To be honest, at, at, like I talked to the McDaniels too. I uh, we we paid them with a car because of all their help with the situation and everything. And uh, they're considered good allies to us because I understood what Winston was going through. Our leader was going through the same thing. To be Sorry, honest, no, I, no, no, I, I, I don't we know. Would... Back up. What'd you say? About what? Your leader. Our leader? Yeah, you know what? I shouldn't have said that, but I, I guess the rabbit's out of the bag now. Uh, our leader had a thing for Juliet. I see. Yeah. Okay. I didn't. I was, uh, me, me and Julia were close friends, and I didn't consider anything more of that because she gave me so much information, and she was just a close friend of mine, and it, it hurt me when she went the way she did. We all mourn. Speaking of, uh, Holiday, is that your second name or first name? Because I would like us to be on a first name basis. Uh, it's my last name, but that's what I have everyone call me. I don't like my first name. It's my uncle's name, and uh, that bastard can burn in hell. I see. Well, just so we're not, you know, calling each other Mr. Holiday, Mr. Collins, you can just call me Keevan. Keevan? Keevan. Uh, well, my, my first name is Leon, so. Yeah, I'll uh, respect your decision of being called Holiday and just still call you Holiday. Yeah, it's a, it's a long story. Yeah. I'd rather not get into that. So, another thing that I did want to speak to you about, and I kind of foreshadowed it at the beginning of this, I spoke about Vibor being this sort of conglomerate of factions, and I I kind of do believe they're the, uh, what should I call it, a community. The Unknown Traders wore uh -huh. yellow armbands, and I saw some guys who I know aren't the Unknown Traders wearing yellow armbands around that area, so I do believe they've uh, merged. I, I think anyway, I'm still, uh -huh. the, the details are all still, still a bit fuzzy, I'm still gathering shit, but, like I said, something of a conglomerate. Um, maybe... Yeah, we got, we got our own communities that we're looking into currently. I mean, if we, if we need to, we'll look into that. 
Oh, hang on, hang on, somebody's on fucking radio, I gotta turn, I gotta turn this off. <laughs> yeah, I turned mine off as well. Respect our conversation. Yeah, alright, so... Maybe in the right time, at the right place... The wolf pack and the silk road can merge as well, and that sort of conglomerate thing. I mean... Yeah, uh, to be honest, I whenever you're ready, I'm ready. I mean, we're ready today. We we need to move out of there because Mobile FK seems to be a hot spot for people that just want to cause problems. Surely. So we're just trying to head out of there. Yeah, I do believe we're in the process of you know actually becoming a community. Yeah, we're uh, mm. we're, we're working on getting our own water pump installed, so we don't have to make a trip in the bears you know, every time we need water. So you know. We're already on the up and up, and having you guys with us will be a certain, a certain boost, a certain welcome boost. Sorry. All right, yeah, that seems that seems good. Yeah, you're the first one I've proposed this idea to actually, so I'll get back to base and set up with the rest of my guys. If you could mention this to Maverick. Uh, yeah, I can. Uh, I can try. All right, cool. Do you have anything else to say? Because I think uh, no, that's all no, they no. want to say this there. Is, this is good. I, I like this. Uh, right. Oh, you know what? I should I should mention this. Uh, some of our members were worried about uh, because once we're moving to Barazina, we're going to be taking over a apartment. Our members were worried about you guys, you know, coming in and maybe demanding stuff. I don't think that would happen, but our wor our members were worried about that. No, no. If you, it's actually on the fly. We don't get involved in shit that doesn't involve, involve us in the first place. You know, we're not soldiers, we're traitors, we don't rob people. I almost got robbed, but, you know, right. that'll be dealt with. Well then, yeah, we're good then. That, that's, that's it. Yeah, no problems then. So, I suppose we should uh, head on back right then. Well, that was not what I meant to do. Oh, that's where it's fucking gone, apparently. <laughs> there we go. Lovely. This has been productive, I think. Oh yeah, no, this is... also a lot for me to learn, because I... To be honest, we only were allies with you because of one person saying, now we're allies because you know we're saying. Not allies, but, you know, good friends. Oh, are we not? Oh. Well, you know, in the flyer it says, you know, nobody's allies with anybody in Silk Road. We're on, our only allegiance is to business and business partners. But maybe if that thing does go through, we can be allies. Not even allies, you know, family, if you, if you want to take it that way. Alright, yeah, that seems good then. Alright, cool. Well, it's nice meeting you guys. Productive. You too. Well, uh, see you around.